you guys we're doing something different today again um i went and saw my folks yesterday it wasn't a day trip i just went to make sure everything was good with them and then i had to come home before but i got off work and went to go look at the tulips and so wanting to get outside while i won't drive south i'm going to try some metal detecting today i'm on a beach i think that right there is one refinery i think that's tesoro and there's another refinery down there which is cherry point BP. but it's a nice day the tide is slowly coming back in it's going to be a while till it comes back in according to the charts i looked online and i do need a permit in washington state to go metal detecting it is free and it's on my phone so if i do get stopped by any fish and wildlife or game department or anything i have it it was it's good for a year but in washington we do need to have one and again it's free and just show the email that it's there I'll show you what I'm working with today. Well, first, I've never used this guy before, and I've only gone metal detecting once. My dad got the this guy right here before he got cancer. And so he said I could use it. I just have to tell him if I get anything cool. This right here is a brand new guy. Got it on Amazon for like 20 bucks. Never used it. It came with a little thing to strap to my belt. It came with the battery. And so if it's pretty good, we'll find out. If it sucks, we'll also find that out too. I am not very good at wearing the camera on my head or my body. So I'm gonna try and see if I could video like this, but I might need both hands. I do have my little tripod on the bottom. So we'll try this for now. And then if I need to, I'll put it on my head. And uh, yeah, let's see if I can find something good. I mean, I think if I find at least three or four things, that's still more than a whole season of the Curse of Oak Island, right? So let's see if we could find anything good. I want to go. I want to walk out just to where that big rock is out there. Sorry that my filming skills on my head sucks. So I can't see where it's pointed. But I was just walking with the metal detector on my way out there trying to figure out if I want to scan up there, there, or right here. It's going to be a lot of work if I did it in the rocks. But as I was walking, I had this turned on for a little bit, and I found this. So it looks like a rock, but no, this is like all metal. I don't know what it is. It might be lead i'm not sure but i'm just kind of impressed that i found this big old chunk of metal so i'm gonna get down here turn the camera on and i'll film my walk back to where everybody parked if anybody can tell me like what this is it is a chunk of metal hold on let me try and give a better view see turn it on my bounty hunter oh, i guess it's telling me i gotta do something there but watch See, it's digging on that thing. But was there something in here? I just turned it on. And I heard it beep. And I'm just trying to find the sweet spot of where stuff might be all the way up there. Right along the rocks here where it might get snake going back out. I'm not sure. I was hoping to find some like sea glass or something as I'm walking. Haven't found any yet. I don't want to dig all day looking for agates. So I'd get carried away and next thing you know, the tide would be getting me. But yeah, I'm almost at my spot because yeah the tide has a little ways to go still but it's coming in and so it's going to take a while but it's always better safe than sorry and that water i mean it's a nice day out here i try to take my hoodie off but again that water is ice cold because this is washington so it's cold cold and again i apologize for my videoing skills but i can't see what's on my head now after finding this thing oh and it's turning i better put it in a bag and wash my hands i'll be right back guys I brought gloves and i put one on just because but i figure i could walk out closer to here than it walk back up there higher so why not turn the camera on anyway and see if we could find something cool so i found one big thing if i could find like two more then it's better in a season of Oak Island. The one thing I did learn from Oak Island is when you use a metal detector, you don't want to walk and step. You're just making like a zipper. You want to, like you're painting. But I think if you don't find anything, this will be boring. Like it's peaceful, the water, the sounds. 
been out here for a reason. Yeah, I want to have fun and try something new, but I also want to find something. And you see like rocks and they look all pretty. Then when you get them home and they're dried up, they're back to being ugly. But when they're wet, they're just beautiful. So I'm not finding much down here. So it's going to walk back up there, but that's why I turned it on for a little bit, just to make sure it's working. There's a crab shell. I mean, I'm not hoping to find like a big old gold nugget. Of course, that'd be amazing. But I just want to find cool stuff. And also, if I could help take some more litter off the beach, why not? I'm just appreciative that it's a nice day while the tide is out. You see, when it's weather like this, people want to go look at those fields of flowers. So I'm just trying to find different things to do and make it a positive instead of being, oh, I can't do nothing for a month. I'm just going to try different things. There's a clam shell. But again, I've only done this once before. So if anybody has tips on how I could do it better, efficiently, anything like that, I'm always down to learn more. Oh, a little crabby. Looks like a bird ate it or something. Again, I'm scared. I hope that you guys can at least see what I'm seeing, but right now we're not missing anything. Well, I might be missing stuff and not freshen over it, but not missing out on anything that I know about. Yeah, see, this is why my walk back ring go up a little higher. I thought about walking down the other end of the beach but it's mostly rocks all I saw. I didn't see nice, finer sand and rocks like down here. All right, guys, the, I might kick you for a little bit just cause I might turn this off and just walk down and then turn around cause I'm not having much luck here. That might actually be a real agate. Probably not, too, not clear enough. down here it is turned on are we not we are turned on my battery dead what the heck I put newer batteries in here but why isn't it beeping now oh we might be having difficulties guys hold on I'm gonna kick it and figure out what's going on was this little thing right here wasn't plugged in all the way I got it plugged back in and as I was walking along I heard a mark there so let's see if anything decent oh I'm guessing it's like a little lead pebble can't check my finger because it's got a ring on it nope It beep must have been a little thing. And what's nice is when it fi this finds something, it beeps and shakes. So it makes it really, ooh, I found a little piece of sea glass. I'd like glass a little bigger than that. But there was something here, but it wasn't big enough to, for this little dude to pick up that scanned it. Oh, yeah, that's my ring. But yeah, so let's keep on trucking, guys. rock then we're going to start heading back and see if we could find some good stuff I don't know if I'm up too high we'll find out if it's meant to be found I'll find it as I was walking out I'm like the one nice thing about it is like I can enjoy the water because I'm not one to sit still I can't go swimming in it, it's too cold but doing this I heard it let's see 
Here, I'm just, I apologize for the angle of the camera. Let's try right here. Get out my fancy little pointer. Make sure it was none of those rocks. No more lead balls. It heard something in here. Must not be that big if we're not picking it up anymore. But there is something in here. Let's go off the shovel. I do know with this thing, you have to be very, very close to it. And then once it's on it, it's on it. Let's see. anything in here see something right there hope you guys can see it it out. Probably a little lead pellet. But I'm guessing. Yep. I don't know if you guys can see that. Find it in there somewhere. Where are you pointing? Yeah. Little. I don't know what all these little lead things are for. I found a couple little lead guys already like. What is that from? That's all I'm finding. So far I'd say this little episode of me on the beach is more, who do I have a hole in my bay? Nope. See, there's all the lead things I found plus that rock looking thing that might be charcoal cause it was getting my hands all nasty. One less lead thing on the even though the tide's gonna fix it when I applied for the permit, which you get that same day, says so you gotta cover it all back up. All right, let's keep on going. And even though I'm finding stuff, I, I'm not expecting to find a gold nugget. Something would be, be fun to find something cooler than a piece of lead or an old nail. How far am I from the beach? Kind of want to go or down where it's either smoother. Did I hear something? Maybe not. I like that I could change the pitch of it. Yeah, we're still plugged in, just making sure. It's that right there that came undone earlier. Getting me all excited than nothing. Anything. I'm going slow. Probably just another lead pellet because it. Let's measure it down. It be because I just turned it on. Anything in here worth taking home? Let me, let me 
bring that down a little more. Yes. It's a weak sound, but it's a sound. you on it lights up that's how I can tell if it's on oh it's another piece of lead what is it that has all these lead chunks I don't get it from like welding underwater rigs maybe Another little lead guy. Fudge. I think it's lead. If you guys have been out metal detecting and found something cool on a beach, please let me know to give me hope for next time. So I'll want to do it again. I don't know the battery life on this guy. It's brand new, so I don't leave it on, and it'll probably beep the whole time that it's in my pocket because of my belt. Said there's something in here. Maybe I was a little too eager. Let's find out. Whole bunch of work for another little lead nugget. You turned on. can't be that cool because it probably it's cool to be bigger and be known said so this has a pretty decent range on like on depth wise to the big rocks maybe it's nothing all part of the adventure right okay if I don't find nothing I'm just going to keep on moving. It is turned on, yep. All right, nothing there. We'll keep on moving. Oh, we got people coming. Just plugged in. See if there's something in here. It was a good sign. They're a little lead nugget. <laughs> Add it to my bag, to my side.
I hope this isn't too boring. See, yeah, there's the rock that I wanted to walk out to, and I walked a little bit past it. Let's, is it gonna be another lead nugget? I think I already see it with my naked eye right there. Bet you that's it, I'll set it right there. Yep. And for that being just that little itty bitty guy and to pick it up, that's pretty good, I'd say. Was it plenty more lead? What I'm gonna be looking for now is like silver. And not like the good silver, like the valuable stuff. Might have been it, just right there. There's a beep. Anything in here? There's something, but is it worthwhile? How close is it? Have to be. There's that. Oh, so I mean, the axe is pretty good. There's some. It would stand out at least a good three, four inches. All right, we'll keep on moving. good beep beep for something amazing of course that's what we all want though isn't it but, see any lead stuff right off the top I might have just beat because of my ring. There'll be a TF. It's not picking up nothing. But my shovel. And again, I didn't go out and buy a shovel for this. This is my little gardening shovel. Something in here. Not that. Getting disappointing. I can see why people get started and they stop. Cause it's not about trying to find the treasure, it's just finding something you get excited. When the excitement stops, it's like, I'm going to go find something else that's more exciting. The light's on? Yep, so it's on. I don't know why this guy's picking it up and this guy's not. Just dig anyway. Nope. Nope, must have been nothing. 
disappointing, but keep on trucking. And I got a long ways to go. I'm just now at the rock. Wonder if I need to be up higher. Well, I'll push it up further. But again, this is only my second time, so I'm still learning. I mean, it's the ocean. It's always washing things up and taking things out. I do have headphones for this, but if I want you guys to hear it too, I don't want to wear the headphones. And again, I'm not worried about other people hearing because they're just passing by quickly. See anything good? They're just a shovel. Oh, come on, little pinpointer. Hang on. Just in the wrong spot. Bites on. There's something in here. I moved it though. Play a tent lead ball yep that's a baby all that work for that that's off now yes please comment with some really cool stuff you guys have found so when you out here doing the work you deserve to brag about it I heard something. Don't know what it we'll find out. It beeped in this area, it wasn't that guy. When this thing's on it, it's nice, but then when you don't find it, you know you're off. And I will say, like, I like that, but having a pinpointer is very helpful also. To find the small little lead balls. The rocks. Okay, one more sweep, and if it's... Nothing amazing.
This guy's finding something. And he keeps finding it. I don't know the accuracy of this. I'm still a newbie. Yeah, so it could be a couple inches away and not hearing nothing unless it's deep. Let's try it. Let's see if it's a deep one. Wait, let's double check this again. Should be like in that area. Mmm. Oh, is that a shovel? My bad. Did find something in there? in there nope that's where it all comes from when you see me push it into the ground like that I'm changing the pitch of it oh that was a good beat Oh, I don't even have to get the little pointer out. Ta-da! If only that had a price like silver or gold, I'd be making money. I might be on a good little like path here. I just jinx myself. Right there. Add it to the bag. Was that my hole? Gotta fill it back in, even though the tide will. Or if there's anybody in Northwest Washington watching this video. I'd appreciate if you could tell me some places to find cool stuff besides lead. Or I guess we'll keep on trucking. Where's the camera pointed at? Hopefully you guys can see it. interfere with it. Hear that boat out there. All right, do I see a little silver bowl yet? Unfortunately, that's all I'm expecting to find. Come on, pinpointer. Oh, right there. WTF. But it's finding them. They're both doing their job and helping me find stuff. Just haven't scanned anything besides lead. Hey guys, sorry about that. My battery died. But I'm done for the day. I only found like two more things. I, I think it was only a couple more. And of course it was all that. I did find a bottle cap. I had fun, I'm gonna do it again, but I'm gonna do some research online and see better places to go. And if I should do it higher, closer to the water. Cause again, all I found was lead 
in all the layers but i'll show you what i got i got that big chunk right there that thing that is metal that looks just like a rock but it like turned my hand black and then those right there are all my little pellets and there's the bottle cap i found so i found something else which is good but now i have to go home count up see what i got and then so that time that way next time i come back out i'll have to find more than that and i would say today was more successful than probably two seasons of oak island thanks again guys i appreciate you and if today wasn't too bad then please click like or subscribe thanks again guys